What's up friends, my name is Sebi and today I'm going to be leading you through a 12 minute workout focusing on the speed skater move. The speed skater move is a plyometric move that will focus on increasing your cardiovascular ability as well as strengthen your legs. So let's go ahead and get started with high knees in 3, 2, 1. Pick up those knees to your chest. We're just building up our heart rate right now as a warm up. From the side, as you can see, my knees are going up. Now in 10 seconds, I want you to switch to butt kicks where you will kick your heels to your butt in three, two, one. From the front, it should look like this. The speed skater move will challenge your balance as well as your leg strength. And I'll walk you through how to do it and all the different variations. We're gonna do 40 seconds of work, 20 seconds of rest. So we're gonna go to tempo speed skater in three, two, one. Jump to the left leg, jump to the right leg, kicking your opposite leg to the back. Take your time with this and make sure to breathe. When you land, soft bend in the knees and jump from one side to another. You have 10 more seconds. Nice. Keep up the good work. So next what we're going to do is we're going to rest for 20 seconds. Since this is a Tabata style workout, we're going to be working for 40 seconds, resting for 20. So the next thing we're going to do is what I call a shuffle skate. In between each skater move, you're going to step, step, and land on your leg. Three, two, one, let's go. Step, step, shuffle, and skate. Once you get the movement, Go a little bit faster. This is going to challenge your quickness and agility. Make sure to stay low in those shuffles. Nice. Keep it up. All right. We're going to rest in four, three, two, one. Nice job. Now what we're gonna do is change directions with our skaters. So what you wanna do is, when you're facing forward, be on your left foot. Then when you jump, face to your right, and land on your right foot. We're just gonna alternate back and forth between those two moves. Let's go. Three, two, one. From left foot to right foot. And changing directions. Take your time with it. Then once you got the hang of it, go a little bit faster. If you need to put your back foot down for balance, go for it. But if you want to challenge yourself and your stability, land on one foot. Nice. Keep it up. We're almost there in three, two, one. Great. Nice job. 20 seconds of rest. So the fourth move we're going to do is wide skaters. I want you to jump as far as you can, and when you land, reach your hand to the ground. This will challenge your power and also give you a cardio boost. Let's go in three, two, one. Down. And jump wide. Make sure to reach down and land softly on your feet, on your toes and your heels. Almost there. All 
I hope you're sweating already, because I am. All right, break in three, two, one. Nice. So the last one we're gonna do, we're gonna do speed skaters. So focus less on reaching down and more on the quick footwork. We're gonna get started in three, two, one. Speed skaters. Go as fast as you can. Still land on one foot, but hop back and forth as fast as you can. Nice. I see you working. Keep it up. We're almost at the halfway mark of our workout. In three, two, one, take a break. 20 seconds off. So we're gonna do that whole circuit again. Tempo skaters. Then we're gonna do all the other moves one at a time. I'll walk you through it during our rest periods. All right, we're gonna get started in five, four, three, two, one. Tempo, regular speed. Go with the beat. Focus on landing on your heel and your toe. Make sure you keep your balance. Fifteen more seconds. Make sure to breathe and get water. Towel off whenever you need it. Break in three, two, one. Nice. Now we're gonna do the shuffle skater. So remember, shuffle, land. Shuffle, land. This is gonna challenge your agility. Now that you know what's coming up, Try to go a little bit faster. Three, two, one, let's go. Shuffle, skater, shuffle, skater. Nice. For this move, it's not about how far you go, but how quickly you move on your toes. Keep going. Almost there. Stay low. Stay on. Three, two, one. Quick break. Good job. So now we're going to change directions, but instead of facing the right, when we land on our left foot, we'll face left. This is going to challenge your balance, especially in the turn in midair. All right. Getting to work in three, two, one. From the right foot, face left. Keep your eyes on the prize. Keep working hard. We're already more than halfway through our workout. So put all of your effort into these last few moves. If you need to regain your balance, just put your foot down for a second, then jump right back up. Three, two, one, break. Good job. All right, second to last move. We're going to jump as wide as we can, reach our hands to the floor. You also can use a little bit more bend in the knee to reach down to the ground. The point is just to touch the ground, not hold on to it. Let's go in three, two, one. Wide skaters, let's go. If you can go faster, go for it. There's nothing holding you back except for your own mind. I don't know about you, but my legs are feeling it.
stop in three, two, one. Nice. Last move. Give it your all. Speed skaters. Quick movements. Make sure to keep focused and keep your balance. We're going to go in five seconds. Four, three, two, one. Give it your all. Last move. Speed skaters. Keep going, you're almost there. You're so close. Give it your all. Three, two, one. Break. All right, let's do a quick cool down for a couple of minutes. So what we're gonna do to cool off, which is always important after a workout, is to stretch and reach down. Keep your right foot in front and your left foot just slightly in the back. So reach down in three, two, one. Keep your, get a hold of your breath. Towel off if you need to. Feel that stretch in your hamstring and your calf. You worked really hard, so make sure to treat yourself and acknowledge that even if you didn't go as fast as you could, you got through the workout. All right, let's switch sides. So left foot in front, right foot slightly in the back just for balance. Reach down to your toes. If you need to bend your knees slightly, that's totally fine. The point is not to reach as low as you can, but rather feel the stretch in the back of your leg. All right, and break in three, two, one. Good job, everyone. That's your speed skater 12 minute workout. Come join me again for Jumpstart January for more workout videos of this length, focusing on one move. Good luck and see you in the next video.